Hi there. This time, I just want to share with you guys a cool freeware program that basically allows its users to enhance or edit um, images or pictures. The idea behind this video is actually from a YouTube friend of mine. It's from the Trousty Man. I do hope I pronounced that right. And it says here that uh, I have a suggestion for a video. Find some programs to unblur pictures. So I, I'm actually going to show you one program that does that, but there are a bunch of other image editing software out there. It's just that I think uh, GIMP is um, does that and it's absolutely free. So I think that's pretty cool, but I don't want to take credit for uh, finding it because I had found it from a subscription of mine called S Scratch Chalk and um, he has some cool tutorial videos about GIMP and other programs that you might want to check out and also I advise you guys to check out Deadly Fury 16 my YouTube partner he has some great great tutorial vids that you might want to check out so there we go with those said on with the point of this vid so basically I'm going to show you how I unblur images or how I unblur blurred images using GIMP. Fair warning, I'm not really a pro in this field but I just want to show you how I did mine. And I assure you guys you can do way better of what I'm about to show you. So let's just get on with it. So first off is this blurred image of a pizza. I'll just drag it to the program to show you. So, just wait for it to load. Anytime. Okay, there we go. So, this is my blurred. Uh, pizza so you can have two options as you edit your image or as you want to uh, unblur your image this is the first option using a blur or sharp sharpen tool because sharpen is actually the opposite of the blur so just click on sharpen here and basically you can sharpen certain sections of your image and you can do this manually. Uh, another option is quicker and this is using filters like so. So just go to filters then go to enhance then go to unsharp mask and it will open a window like so. So I'm just going to minimize this. So with this um, you are able to alter uh, your well basically your image and uh, it's all up to you on how you would set your preferences and how your image would look like and for this case um, you are the one who is going to set the degree of sharpness your Im you want your image to have so I'll just enter some values here so whatever it is that you're entering in this field is reflected on the preview image here so I'm just going to mm, click 4. So it's all up to you on how you set your values as you, well, unblur or sharpen your image. So I'm just going to click OK. Wait for it to load. Like so. But I'm going to show you my original picture so we can compare. Okay, this is how it looks like uh, before, and now it looks like this. So, uh, as I had said, you could do way better than this, but uh, just clearly shows how uh, sharper and clearer it is from the 
original one and um, uh, that's basically how I unblur uh, blurred images so I'm just going to try another one I'm just going to close this this time I'm going to try an image of a train so we'll just drag that to our program there there we go so basically this is a blurred image of a train and I'm going to apply the same method so click filters then uh, enhance then uh, and sharp mask and then basically uh, put on your values here. So put in your values. So I'm just going to click 50 and 3 and click OK. So there you go. And again, to compare, this is basically my original image and this is my edited image. So that is how I unblur my images using GIMP and I also advise you guys to check out the other tools that you can use here uh, there is a smudge tool, a burn tool, text tool, a bucket fill tool and many other tools that you can use to further enhance your image so there you go Those, um, actually that is a program I wanted to share and thank you for watching this video and also, of course, thanks to uh, Lee Trousty Man for the suggestion. I do appreciate that. So, there you go. Again, thanks for watching and just have fun.